On February 7th, 2015 at 10.33 p.m., Austin police officers were dispatched to a shots fired call in the 8200 block of Pax Drive. The suspect in this case is a white male named Sawyer Flatch, date of birth 8-12 of 1987. The involved officer was senior APD officer Luke Serato. Officer Serato is a seven year veteran of the Austin Police Department and has served on the police SWAT team for three years now. Once officers arrived on scene, they reported hearing several shots being fired. When Air One arrived on scene, officers on the ground could hear more gunfire near their location and began to take cover. The tactical flight officer inside Air One observed the suspect appearing to shoot his weapon in the direction of the patrol officers that had responded to the scene. APD patrol officers approached the location on foot and also saw the suspect carrying a rifle, pointing that rifle up in the air at the direction of Air One, which was hovering overhead. The tactical flight officer inside Air One continued watching the male and saw him kneel down beside a boat that was located in the driveway next to an SUV. The suspect appeared to use the boat as a support base while again taking aim at Air One overhead with a long rifle. The tactical flight officer stated multiple shots were being fired at the APD helicopter in which he and the uh, pilot were operating. The APD SWAT team was asked to respond to the scene and arrived. Upon their arrival, the officers deployed at approximately 11.58 p.m. A SWAT officer observed the suspect carrying a long rifle at this time as well. SWAT officers heard from the tactical flight officer in the helicopter that the suspect was shooting at the helicopter. The SWAT officers uh, formed a team that moved up into a position to make contact with the suspect at this time. As they got into position, they were able to observe the suspect uh, in the driveway where he had been on and off throughout this occurrence. Uh, one of the APD officers assigned as a sniper took up a position to observe the suspect and while observing the suspect, uh, he noted, observed him go back down into a prone position, taking a long rifle, aiming it up in the direction of Air One overhead, uh, and believing that he was about to again fire at Air One, putting the lives of the officers inside Air One in an immediate danger, he fired one shot, and that shot struck the suspect in this case and fatally wounded him.